Welcome to StreetLawsLegalTimelines.org, where you can find our legal timelines in American history. This short video will teach you how to use the online tools that are part of each interactive timeline. We'll use the Safeguards of Justice timeline, but you can find all the timelines under the drop-down menu above. So here we can see the title, then our timeline, then below that the learning activities that go with the timeline if you're assigned any inquiry packs. To access the interactive timeline, we can scroll up to find the first entry. There are a few different ways that you can navigate the interactive timeline. First, you can use the arrows to scroll from one timeline event to the next or to go back. Notice that as I click through the events, the timeline visual below moves too. This is a great way to go through the timeline in order. You can also move through the timeline by scrolling through it. Just scroll left or right if you're using a trackpad, or click and drag your cursor in the direction that you want to go. From here, you can click on any of the events you see to open them up. When you click an event, a text entry will come up and sometimes will have a paired visual. Any words in the entry that are bolded and underlined are also defined in the glossary. You can click those words to pull up the definition on a new page. The text typically also has a source link below. You can click on the link to find out more about the event. Sometimes there may be a lot of events in one area of the timeline, and you may need to zoom in to see them more clearly. You can use the zoom in and out buttons on the left side of the screen to navigate. Make sure to click on an event on the timeline near the area you want to zoom in on before clicking the zoom in button. The zoom feature will center around whichever timeline event was most recently highlighted. And note that if you press the back arrow underneath the zoom buttons, this will take you back to the beginning of the timeline. And one final note, some of the timelines will have labels like you see on the left side here to help you better understand the timeline. On this timeline, the placement of each event into one of the different bars helps you to see which constitutional amendment the entry is related to. Not all of the timelines have this feature. And that's it. You're now ready to use Street Law's legal timelines in American history.